Welcome to Miniatures.de, your military miniatures magazine. In this issue, we will convert Revell 1 to 72nd scale Swedish musketeers into pikemen. This conversion is indicated because the box contains 29 musketeers, but only 7 pikemen. A Swedish infantry company consisted of 16 officers and sergeants, and 126 rank and file, of whom 54 were pikemen and 72 musketeers. If we wanted to recreate this ratio using Revelle's Swedish infantry, we would have to convert 8 musketeers into pikemen. And indeed, every one of the 6 musketeer poses in this set can be converted to a very convincing pikeman. We begin by removing the musket, the powder tubes on the figure's chest, and the large gunpowder flask. Once these items have been removed, we roughly carve the musketeer into shape as best as we can. The final cleanup can be done with a soldering iron or modeling compound so that any unsightly spots of our carving work will be removed. Of course, some of the damage will be hidden when we add the pike. Now the miniature's hands are opened up using a 0.5mm micro drill. The holes are enlarged using a 0.8mm micro drill so that a plastic broom bristle can be inserted later. Make sure to drill these holes at the same angle so that the pike will go through both hands in a straight line. Here too we begin with a 0.5mm drill and then extend the bore hole with a 0.8mm drill. Now push a plastic broom bristle through both hands. Flatten the tip of the bristle using pliers. and cut the flattened tip into a spear point. Pikes were at least 4.2 meters to 5.1 meters long, which is the equivalent of 58 to 70 millimeters in this scale. Now take the next musketeer through the same process. Remove the musket and everything that goes with it, the musket rest, the tubes on the bandolier, and the large powder flask. Try to clean up the figure as best as you can by removing most of the excess plastic.
Now the hands are drilled open, starting with the 0.5 millimeter drill and following up with 0.8 millimeters. This musketeer's right hand is so small that we're going to have to drill through the back of the hand to ensure that there is enough plastic material to surround the pike and hold it. This workaround will be hardly visible once the miniature is painted, but purists may want to remodel the hand using a soldering iron or milli putt. Push the pike through the back of the right hand Flip the end of the pike forward and insert it into the left hand. Now cut the flattened tip of the pike into a spear point. This musketeer has a broken arm which will be soldered back on in a separate tutorial, linked in the description. Right, and this is what the former musketeers look like, now that we've converted them to pikemen. And these are the three other musketeer poses in this set, which also make convincing pikemen. Thank you for watching. For more information, please visit our website at miniatures.de.